And we might. Shall. We could. Shall. shall. We may. We shall. We shall live in his sight. sight. Yeah. You may be seated. Praise God. Now I'll close the Bible. Go to John, the 11th chapter. John 11, side of verse 1. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to lay a little foundation right fast. John 11, verse 1 reads, Now a certain man was sick, named Lazarus of Bethany, the town of Mary, and her sister Martha. It was that Mary which anointed the Lord with ointment and wiped his feet with her hair, whose brother Lazarus was sick. Therefore, his sister said to him, saying, Lord, behold, he whom thou lovest is sick. Right. When Jesus heard that, he said, the sickness is not unto death, but for the glory of God, Amen. that the Son of God might be glorified thereby. Now, Jesus loved Martha and her sister and Lazarus. When he had heard, therefore, he, that he was sick, he abode two days still in the same place where he was. Let's go down to verse 11. <laughs> These things he said, said he, and after that he said to them, our friend Lazarus sleep, but I go that I may awake him out of sleep. If you want a thing, something to take home, you on, text message your friend, put on your Google, MySpace, your space, MySpace, Facebook, you know. On Sundays, if you ever go on Facebook, you know the pastor preach because they say they name and then he is and then coming out of this or something like that, you know, they, they inspire on that Sunday. But, but today, if you look at your name today, hey. hey. make sure, hey. make sure. Hey. you don't bury the glasses too soon. Too soon. Don't dare that. Too soon. Now, as we look at this story here, we find that uh, our brother Lazarus is a little ill. Matter of fact, somebody said he could have been on life support if they would have had uh, the ailment that he had had caught up to him to the point where it was taking his very breath and his very life away from him. And, and, and it, it, it seemed that, that, that if Jesus didn't hurry up and go see about him, that maybe Lazarus wasn't going to make it through the night. And, and I find that, that even in, in our lives nowadays, we have young people that, that are going through this and going through that uh, kind of situation. And, and we're like, well, well Pastor, if you, you don't come to the house and pray, uh, pretty soon the, the June bug ain't going to make it. He, he, he might be going to jail and, and he might get shot. And, and I, I'm just not sure that we're going to be able to make it to the I'm not, I'm not, look now, I need you to come over, I need you to come see about him now. I've called you an ample amount of time so that you can come and, and, and do something about this. But, but I found out that, you know what, God knows just what he's doing. Oh, yeah. Right. And, and, and the Bible says that after Jesus heard about this, heard about the condition, he stayed where he was. Mm -hmm. Now somebody would have thought that he would have got on a horse, a camel, mm -hmm. a donkey, mm -hmm. or something, and he would have rolled out and to get to 